Okay, last thing of the week, team. We are on Friday. Warm up, five minutes, okay? So just gonna get nice and warm for more upper body focused Friday session. So we're gonna go in, start with five inchworms into a push up and then 20 arm circles back and forth. And really, all I want us to do is four, probably four minutes on this, just hitting those two movements. I want you to be nice and slow on the inchworm and then just get those shoulders really mobile, okay? So that inchworm, we're gonna go down, try and get our hands to the floor without bending our knees, and then out we go to our push-up position, and then back up, walking it back up, okay? So five of those into 20 arm circles, starting small forward, and then 20 arm circles going back, okay? So five minutes, just cruise through those two pieces, get our upper body moving, get our core uh, nice and tight from the working from the inchworms and then we can move on from there, okay? So after that warm up then, we're gonna move into uh, completing 100 push-ups, okay? So this is the aim of the game. This is, this is one big chunk. We've still got a, oh, like a, a Metconny workout piece afterwards, but a bulk of what I want to do today is to get um, 100 push-ups done to whatever your hardest scale is, okay? Um, the main thing that we want to um, we want to be doing is we want to be testing ourselves, okay? So if you're somebody who can do push-ups to the floor, super super slick and easy, and do sets of twenties and thirties and stuff like that, then a hundred push-ups is going to take you no time at all. So I want you to make that difficult. So let's put a negative in, okay? That could be three, could be five seconds, something like that. But if you are just getting confident going on the floor, then you might raise yourself up a little bit. Um, I don't want this to get to a point where we're breaking it down into twos and threes, okay? So I want you to be able to get solid chunks of kind of 10, 10 reps at a time done, okay? So this shouldn't be something that you start doing 20 on, 20, 20, five, three, 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 two, and we, and we really, we've maxed out already, okay? So I want you to be kind of calculated so if I was doing 100 push-ups at the minute, I would be looking at doing 100 push-ups to the floor with a one, two, three second negative in it, and then potentially timing my rest a little bit. So only allowing myself 20 or 30 seconds rest before I start again. So I just want you guys to hit 100 push-ups, however you can, to get that pump on to start with, and just to get some good volume in and the press, okay? So that's our first piece. After that then, we're gonna go into uh, an, a descending, uh, ladder. So we're going to hit 10. Uh, we're going to go hit a 10, 8, 6, 4, and 2 uh, rep scheme. We're going to start with 10 dumbbell snatches. That's going to be on each arm. So we all know that that dumbbell snatch is going to go to the floor every time, close to the body, squeeze up, and catch under. Okay? So we're going to do 10 on one arm, 10 on the other. Once we've done those 10 dumbbell snatches, then I want 10 nice wonderful gymnastic looking hollow rocks. So where we really think about our toes pointed, arms out behind our head, and we're gonna rock for 10, okay? Once we've done those 10 hollow rocks, we're gonna go into um, 10 burpees, okay? So we all know a burpee, I don't need to demo that, we're just gonna hit 10 burpees. We're gonna finish the round off, and this number doesn't change with 30 double unders, 60 single unders, 60 star jumps, whichever one you wanna do or can do, okay? So that's 10, 10, 10. Then we're gonna go 8, 8, 8, 6, 6, 6, 4, 4, 4, 2, 2, 2, done, okay? So we're just gonna send down that uh, and just get our heart rate up, get moving really nicely, and that's, that's our work done for the day there. We're gonna finish Friday off with, again, just a little bit of core, core work where I want us to do 10, uh, one minute, so we're gonna do three rounds of one minute worth of ipsilateral um, dead bugs, and then we're gonna follow that minute up by doing 12 leg over, raises over an object, okay? So, we'll be on our backs from there, and then the ipsilateral dead bug, the shoulders just come slightly up off the floor, so we're active here. My legs are, are locked out as best I can. My toes are facing down to me. My hands come up, and then from there, opposite hand and opposite leg move. So from there, I go down, trying to keep that position, and I come back up. Down, keep that position, 
and come back up. So I'm going to go for a minute of that, and then once my minute's done, I'm going to hit up into my hollow rock. You can see my weights down here. I'm just going to move my, my feet over that way. Okay, one, one, two, three, four, all the way to 12, okay? And then that's around. So once everybody's through that, if, we, if you're in the class, we'll do a minute. Then everybody will do their deadlifts. We'll all get ready to start again, and then we'll, we'll crack on, okay? So we're going to hit three rounds of that core work, and then you are done for the day. You are done for the week. If you've managed to get it all in, well done. It was lovely to see so many people on Monday when I coached. Um, so yeah, have a great one with this, guys. Hopefully you can get on a Zoom class as well.